We're here to describe the action for you. Nice to have you with us. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith. Nottingham Forest in our featured match today against Sheffield Wednesday. Nottingham Forest looking for some reaction after that away loss in their last game against West Ham. Yeah, that 2-1 defeat would have uh, come as a surprise, I think, to many within the ground. But uh, they've got some match winners within this team and I think they can use them. I think they can, they can grab a win. It is a success for the host today, based so far on shutting out the opposition. Well, some people call this side boring, but not for me, because uh, they just love their clean sheets, don't they? Good game. Have a great game. Thanks. Good game. Thanks. Cheers. Good luck. Thanks. Hey. Bye. Good luck. Cheers. Good game out there. Good luck. Cheers. Thanks. And this is the way Nottingham Forest are going to go into this match. 4-3-3. And they've got natural wide players in that front three with a central striker. I think that's the key because those lads on the flanks, complicated job actually because they've got to come inside, support the centre forward and they've also got to funnel back when they've got the ball. So an onus on them. Let's look at Sheffield Wednesday and the list of their players here. Well, it looks like all hands to the defence. At least they've got two forwards. Yes, and uh, hopefully they will get some service, but uh, it is capable, this shape of negative. Well, we're underway here. Attacking well here. Chance from the pass. To put them in front. Mooney. Threads it through. It should be. Well, they got away with it in the end. Sam Winnell. Attacking now. Must score. Well, sometimes these opportunities can come too early, and maybe this is one of them. Yeah, maybe just caught cold there, wasn't expecting the chance to land at his feet and made a mess of it. <laughs> Liam Bridcut. Mooney. There's some potential in this move. Shots up! That's an offside decision. Well, the players can't believe it, and neither can the crowd, but it's the right decision. What did you make of it, Alan? Well, I thought he was onside, you know, but uh, he's gone through and tucked it away. But looking at the replay, yes, he had gone a bit early. Now, this looks promising. That's a wonderful... Oh, he's through. Brilliant pass, can he finish it? This with a chance to go into the lead now. He scored! Fantastic start. Really quick off the blocks here. They've given themselves a terrific boost for what lies ahead.
He looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said, right, I've got the win here, and he's got the goal to show that. And I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right. So here we are, Nottingham Forest have the lead. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. And here's a chance. Surely. Quick witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. Striding forward. Could score. Opportunity here. This could be useful, actually. Space for the shot. What a lovely death finish that was. Well, they all count the same, but he won't ever get an easier one. No, I don't think so. But uh, he was there, right place, right time. And here is another angle on that goal. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Good play until they got that challenge in. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. And they've cut it out. Mooney. Fine play from Nottingham Forest, getting really onto the front foot now. Oh, it could be off. The referee has acknowledged the flag from his assistant and given the offside. We've had a mobile phone handed in. If you've lost your mobile phone, can you please make Keep your way to ball. reception after the game? Thank you. Attacking now. Liam Bridcut. Sam Winnell. And he goes on goal. Very good tackle. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. 
Wonderful chance. They can't stop him. Saw the goal and went for it. And it's a goal here. Well, he managed to keep it down, put it into the back of the net, and the keeper just couldn't reach it. Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. Important moment, maybe the most important moment in the match. They shouldn't be caught from here, should they, Alan? I don't think so. There'd be questions asked if... To be honest with you, Martin, position looks down and out down there. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Sam Winnell. Sam Hutchinson. It's looking good, this move. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Ashkan De Jagger. Now, can he take them on? Great pass! Our chance! Got to keep his nerve here. Well, that's the sign of a top-class player, to score like that. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion, rightly so, well in the lead. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view. He's in here. Well, that's a goal with class written all over it. He looks wonderful when it comes off. Not quite so when he doesn't. He took it with greater plum. I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the chance to grab the second chance here. And here is another angle on that goal. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. On the attack here. Has to score. They score. Well, he's not far out, but you've got to be on your toes in these circumstances, and he was. Well, it's ended up in the back of the net, quite high up too. Yeah, I'm not sure whether he actually meant it just to go under the bar. Maybe we'll find out afterwards. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Palmer. Good position, lovely ball. It's good to win the ball back because the counter-attack was looming rather large. That's a brilliant challenge. Quick wit. Nice for the shot! Very exciting times for the manager, a real compliment to his ability because he's now got the coaching role of a national team on top of these club duties. Well, that's right, whether uh, he's uh, his club chairman uh, will be 
happy with that. I'm sure they've discussed it, but uh, it's an extra workload for him and uh, the, his club will just hope it doesn't distract from the job that he does here. This could be it. He's in the clear. He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. Needs to stay cool now. They've opened them up. And that's dealt with the problem. Attacking now. Can finish it off. Great stop. Coming up, a corner. The space to go forward. Opportunity here. They can't stop him. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Surely. Never panicked. Placed it past the goalkeeper. They play an open brand of football, so we shouldn't be surprised with a defender chipping in with one of the goals. But he looks a bit surprised. Yeah, I mean, it's not like he's never scored a goal before, but uh, he found himself in the position. He didn't hesitate. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Liam Palmer. Here's a chance to attack. Opening them up with a... Must score! So close, the post! Sam Winnell. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Liam Brickcut. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Some options now for the pass. He's in here. And the ball's in. It's a goal. It's his third goal. It's a hat trick today. He's really been on. What a day he's having. Three goals now. He's been a thorn in the side of the opposition all match, and he thoroughly deserves that hat-trick. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Sam Hutchinson. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Well, he was in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Kieran Lee. Strong, fair challenge, balls out for a throw, though. Fox. Sam Hutchinson. Slipping it through. Real opening now. Steered in very classily. And that's...
that's another brilliant shot and another brilliant goal. Well, they don't come around too often, but as a striker, I know it's a wonderful feeling when you're so confident in front of goal. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Strong challenge. Can really get at the opposition here. Real chance. It comes out of the goal, and it's in for the goal. Well, he's not far out, but you've got to be on your toes in these circumstances, and he was. Well, he might be a defender by name, but he's got an attacker's instincts, as this shows. Well, his teammates are all over him. They know he's capable of doing that. I think he does it plenty of times in training. This one's valuable. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Nottingham Forest on the attack here, looking good. Oh, chance! Oh, it's the post! Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. Really couldn't miss from there. Well, the keeper had no chance. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. There's some potential in this move. That's a brilliant challenge. Taking on the defenders. Should be. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. And this is going to be a throw. <laughs> Mooney. Switch of emphasis going inside. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Surely! And that will clear the danger. Corner to be taken. Well, this guy looks like he's the one the opposition are having the most problems with. Well, the defence knew all about him beforehand, but they really haven't got tight enough. And as a result, he's been working the keeper, and he's got on the Tasne a few times. Now, this is an interesting attack. It's on the move all and makes lots of these interceptions. Now, this looks promising. Clever ball. Real opening now. Oh, how cheeky is that? Takes a lot of bottle to try that, but he's got it. 
He looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said, right, I've got the win here, and he's got the goal to show that. I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Sam Winnell. I like the look of this attack. Opening them to finish it off. Looking to take the corner quickly. really get at the opposition here real chance well, that's the sign of a top-class player to score like that one more look at what happened earlier could the defender have done anything different Alan well maybe he's half turned away and that didn't help if he'd have closed it down a bit more bravely it might have been better I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Has to score! Well, he tried to place it, and could hardly have placed it further from the goal. I can only think that got a horrible bobble, yo, that was a shocker. Mooney. Cleverly done. There's space for the shot. That's hit the bar and it's still in play. Into the attacking third. Wonderful chance. What a brilliant goal. Well, he managed to keep it down, put it into the back of the net, and the keeper just couldn't reach it. Well, he's not far out, but you've got to be on your toes in these circumstances, and he was. You've got to admire the way he placed the ball into the bottom corner of the net. But the goalkeeper was in a decent position, but he was helpless to uh, stop that one going in. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Sam Hutchinson. Nottingham Forest on the attack here, looking good. Must score! And it's in the net for the goal! Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances, and it is a knack. Well, he got to the position of maximum opportunity. It was an impossible opportunity to squander. Yeah, we often say it was an easy chance, but you have got to be there, and uh, this lad has got the knack of doing that. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing.
Well, this is a truly outstanding start to the game. A fantastic first half. Sam Hutchinson. Well, they could pose some danger now. They've opened them up here. Never panicked. Placed it past the goalkeeper. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal, and he took it in excellent style, just like the first one. Well, let's take another look at the goal. The opposition in danger of being blown away here by the remarkable start to the game from the team that's taking them to the cleaners. The well, that will encourage one or two players. Still five minutes to go of added time. No time for an extra touch after the tackle. It's out of harm's way. It's fine play from Nottingham Foot. It's a quick break. Now the shot! Goalkeeper can only parry it out. Can he do it? Real chance. They've defended with great organisation to get possession back after big pressure for some time. And shoots! Splendid goal here. And that's the third, the hat-trick. It's a day he'll never forget. They will be signing the match ball for him afterwards because of a hat-trick. Yeah, he won't forget this day in a hurry. Top stuff from him. You don't often see this, such a one-sided first half. They never really got going, the opposition, and they're surely out of the contest almost before it began. McKay. Let's go. Here's a chance. Here's a chance, the goalkeeper exposed. Great work by the goalkeeper, great hands. That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Threading it through, wonderful chance! It's a goal! Nothing like for a manager seeing a goal like that. Real team effort. Great understanding between those lads down there. Well, they all count the same, but he won't ever get an easier one. No, I don't think so. But uh, he was there, right place, right time. And here is another angle on that goal. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. Well, sometimes games take a while to ignite. Not this one, not for this team. Well, I like the look of this attack. Palmer, Sam Hutchinson, got the ball back in his own penalty area though, half time here and who would believe this scorer? Well the hosts are winning here and they're winning well at half time. And with their defensive record, who would bet against them not winning this match? Now, this looks promising. Clever ball. Real opening now. 
really get at the opposition here. Real chance. Well, that's the sign of a top-class player to score like that. Nottingham Forest on the attack here, looking good. Must score! And it's in the net for the goal! Defended with great organisation to get possession back after being under pressure for... And shoots! It's an easy interception. Threading it through. Wonderful chance! It's a goal! Sheffield Wednesday. Well, we wonder if the second half is going to be like the first one sided. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. This could be it. The shot's on. Great stop. There'll be a signal here at the corner. He's very confident with the ball at his feet. And there's the cutback. Magnificent. Cut off. That's a good block. Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. A real opening for him. Steered in very classily. He took it with greater plum. I'm sure getting the first goal gave him the confidence to grab the second chance here. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was... Very well taken. One team really on their game today, the other very off colour. Number seven, Liam Bridcourt. On the move and able to cut out the puck. Armand Traore. Oh, the pass, which looked a good one, was just cut out in the nick of time. Gone out over the touchline, that'll be a throw to the opposition. Liam Palmer. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw.
This is how they love to play on the break. And here's the shot. And this is a goal. Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances. And it is a knack. He took a chance to get in there, and the ball just fell perfectly for him. Couldn't miss from there. No, he couldn't. Point blank effort. But uh, you have got to be in the positions, haven't you, to miss them? The old saying goes true. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. It was good progress with this attack. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. And they've cut it out. Liam Bridcut. Going forward well. We well, could be in. He's got his shot off now. Oh, well saved. Goalkeeper's done well. That wasn't a good... It will be a free kick. Just take a note of this, EA Sports coverage of the EFL Championship fixture for Nottingham Forest. They'll be facing Queen's Park Rangers. Yeah, a lot of people have been talking about this one. Looking forward to it. Good defending. Ashkan De Jagger. Cleverly done. He's in. Space for the shot. Delightful touch to score the goal. Well, he got to the position of maximum opportunity it was an impossible opportunity to squander yeah we often say it was an easy chance but you have got to be there and uh, this lad has got the knack of doing that well it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Lee. Liam Palmer. Well, they're in a good position here. Kieran Lee makes a challenge here. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Slipping it through. Wonderful chance. Into the attacking third. Mooney. The break is definitely on. Real chance. The ball's loose. Goalkeeper made the save, but he couldn't hold it. The shot's on. And that shot's blocked very quickly. Either side able to dwell on the ball. Guiding it through the defenders. Here's a chance.
Well, that will be a throw. Well, we're at the time of the game where the strikers get taken off, whether they play well or not, Alan. It's just a fact of life. I wouldn't want to be a forward these days, and perhaps you wouldn't want to be either. Um, anyway, he's off, and he, he hasn't played very well in truth, has he? No, the defenders have had him in their pockets because uh, his movement's not been good enough. Certainly, he's lacked pace today. I don't know what's the matter with him. Shots on here. No real trouble for the goalkeeper. Getting forward well as a team now. Surely! Steered in very classily. Well, if you keep going in to that sort of area, the ball will drop for you, and it dropped perfectly for him. I think that's a lesson to anybody uh, in due in a goal drought. Keep getting into the positions in the 18-yard, in the six-yard box, and you will score. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Gary Hooper anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Attacking well here. It could be a chance. Wonderful goal. Well, they look pleased with themselves and no wonder with the way they stroked the ball about and created the finish, picked out the spare man in the box. He took a chance to get in there, and the ball just fell perfectly for him. Couldn't miss from that. No, he couldn't, point-blank effort. But uh, you have got to be in the positions, haven't you, to miss them? The old saying goes true. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Referee sees that as a foul, and it is a free kick. Well, when you have the quality and the width, that's what this lad brings. You've got a special talent, and uh, it's been... Uh, a special showing as he's replaced now, the crowd recognising that. Yeah, what he's done, he, he's hugged the touchline and he's stretched that opposing back line, created space for teammates inside and vital performance from him. McKay on the attack here, going forward well, has to score! He's in now. Hit the frame of the goal after the save. Well, they line up for the corner. In goes the corner. And it's a touch over the bar. And yet another corner. Got 
past him. And here's the shot. And they've managed to score here. Well, if you look back through the archives, you'll see that this player has scored quite a few from these kind of distances. And it is a knack. Right on the spot to score. That's not the hardest goal he's ever scored, but he was in the right place. Let's see the replay now. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Gone out over the touchline, that'll be a throw to the opposition. <laughs> Liam Bridcut. Mooney, Nottingham Forest on the attack here, looking good. Great chance! And look at him again, he's got the clearance away. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. Well read by the defender. This might be it! Big deflection by the defender there, but the goal will stand. Just looking at that deflection, of course, defenders do get attracted to the ball. He might have been better just letting it go. Yeah, there's an argument to say that. I think the goalkeeper behind him is actually getting that point across now. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Liam Palmer on the move and able to cut out the pass. Into the attacking third. A real opening for him. And they've got in to score here. And that's the third, the hat-trick. It's a day he'll never forget. Well, there is a saying that uh, things come in threes. They've come in threes for him, a hat-trick. Not just three goals, but he's played really well. His overall game has been top class today. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Good try with that back heel. McKay. And there's the cutback. comes the challenge going forward well a real chance here what a lovely death finish that was knocked it away from very close range all about concentration that getting the right strike on it that's a goal well worth analysing again. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. Now he's a bit disappointed he's going to be taken off here, and the manager may be saving him for another day, but also allowing him 
to get the full appreciation from the fans. Well, he was enjoying it. I don't think he wanted to come off, but uh, he's a key part of this team. He's got to be protected. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Liam Bridcut. It's fine play from Nottingham Forest. Getting really onto the front foot now. Shot on! And he knocks in the goal. Well, they've taken the low route here, and they've got themselves a goal well out of the keeper's reach. He's tucked it away, well out of the goalkeeper's reach. I love to see that. Don't have to whack it from that kind of position. Just side-footed home. Well, he's not far out, but you've got to be on your toes in these circumstances, and he was. One team really on their game today, Nottingham the other Forest very off colour. Number seven, Liam Bridgewater. Hooper. Trying to get it wide, and it was a good idea, but he couldn't find his supporting player. They're in a good position here. We oh, he could be in. And here's the shot. That's a very good goal. Well, he's point-blank range, but you've got to be there to score. You've got to be there to miss it as well, but he didn't. Really couldn't miss from there. Well, the keeper had no chance. A good look here. Again, by the replay of the goal. I have to say, it's so one-sided today, but all credit to the team that are racking up the goals. On the attack here. Here's a chance! Oh, he's way off target. Liam Bridcut. Good position. They've worked this. The break is definitely on. The shot's on. Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. <laughs> Ref Stop. For the free kick. Well, the players have done well for this team today, but I think the fans might have done even better. Yeah, and they're uh, really enjoying it now, aren't they? They've got no doubt in their minds that uh, their team is going to win out. Here's Grant. Break quickly when they get possession. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. This might be it! We say so often we get the benefit of these replays and the assistant, of course, has one chance to see it. Did he get it right, Alan? Oh, just about. I mean, that is a, a great call from the official over there. There wasn't much in it, a few inches, really. And it is a, a header away and out of play.
Armand Traore. Nottingham Forest. On the opportunity here. It's a goal. It's his third goal. It's a hat trick today. He's really been on form. What a day he's having. Three goals now. He's been a thorn in the side of the opposition all match, and he thoroughly deserves that hat trick. Oh, he's loving it, the manager. He's seeing his team playing really well, just what he was asking for. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Liam Palmer. Well, I like the look of this attack. Crisp defending there. That's great defensive play from him again. Throw in here. Grant. They've opened them up here. That is a fantastic goal. Hat trick. Goal number three here. And it's a perfect day for the player. Well, a wonderful achievement to get three goals in a team like this against opposition like this. It's a special day. It certainly is. For a special player, too. A player that. Uh, is the clinical sort and he's shown us that today. Well, it's a tough game for the team that are trailing. They're out of the contest really, they're just playing for pride, they're really being torn apart. Now this looks promising. That's a fine challenge, and he's got the ball. Barry Bannon. Can finish it off. Oh, it's off the bar. Throw in to come. Score! What a goal! It's the substitute who scored, and it's a terrific effort by him and by the manager who sent him on. Well, good finish, no doubt, Martin, but what about the play before that? What about the passing? Wonderful team effort. No slacking in these late minutes here, and the chance to extend their lead, and they have uh, voraciously gobbled up the chance. Well, they played some really good football out there today, and that was another example of it. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape, and boy, is it getting results out there. He's coming off now. He is a defensive midfield player, but do you think he could play in all aspects of uh, that particular part of the pitch? He's certainly good on the ball. Yeah, he is. He's one of those. He's just a football appearance, and simple, and he can play in a variety of positions. And this is his, his proper one, his, his favourite one. We saw why today. Coming on strong and looking to play their way through now. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. Here's Grant. Oh, he's through. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. There's a dangerous feel to this attack. It's looking good from their point of view.
backing his own talent here to keep the ball. And he has got some support if he wants to just lay it off. This could be it. He's got his shot off now. And that's the sign of a top-class player to score like that. It's a compliment to their attitude to keep on going and widening the lead here. Yeah, thoroughly professional, and the manager will be delighted with that attitude. The goal, wherever you look at it, it was very well taken. little surprising that it is as one-sided as this late in the game but the team leading deserve the margin of what's going to be a very comfortable victory and the board's gone up from the fourth official five added minutes They've regained possession here, Nottingham Forest. That's good movement forward here. Great chance! Beautifully guided past the goalkeeper. disappointment for the losing team but I'm afraid the winners deserve this margin which has been confirmed by this very late goal yeah it's been a, a walkover you don't often get games like this at this particular level but so one-sided oh he's loving it the manager he's seeing his team playing really well just what he was asking for Well, we're in the last few minutes now, and the die has been cast in this game, really. Number 23, Joe Lolling. Good forward play from them. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. On the move, and cut out the pass. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. Opportunity now, it's a goal! Well, he's only been on the pitch a matter of minutes. I'm not sure he's touched the ball before this, but a vital touch there to score. Pretty straightforward, this match, and the late goal sums it up, really. Yeah, they've just compounded their superiority with that one. Well, here's the goal again. A very comfortable margin for victory. There can't really be any comeback in the time that we've got left. And he's blown his whistle for the last time. Well, undoubtedly, he was the star man today. Yeah, one of those matches, Martin, where everything he touched turned to gold. It was an impeccable performance. As a match, it was rather one-sided, wasn't it? Because of the 
capacity of one team to dominate the football. It was a football lesson, it was pretty humiliating for, for the inferior team, they just didn't get into it. Ashkan De Jagger, cleverly done. He's in, space for the shot. Delightful touch to score the goal. Nottingham Forest on the opportunity here. own talent here to keep the ball this could be it he's got his shot off now and that's the sign of a top-class player to score like that that's good movement forward here great chance beautifully guided past the goalkeeper English Football League Championship. Blackburn Rovers 1, Queen's Park Rangers 1. Brentford 2, West Ham United 1. Charlton Athletic 1, Leeds United 2. Fulham 2, Barnsley 1. Huddersfield Town 0, Birmingham City 2. Ipswich Town 1, Norwich City 2. Middlesbrough 1, Hull City 2. Nottingham Forest, lots, Sheffield Wednesday, nil. Preston North End, two, Derby County, one. Sheffield United, two, Reading, one. Sunderland, one, Cardiff City, one. So what do those results mean to the league table? At the top of the table remain Nottingham Forest with 44 points. In second, rising up the table are Brentford with 36 points. In third and falling are Huddersfield Town with 35 points. In fourth, climbing the table are Fulham with 31 points. In fifth, rising up the table are Birmingham City with 31 points. In sixth, moving down are West Ham United with 30 points. In seventh and falling are Middlesbrough with 29 points. In eighth, Leeds United with 28 points. Bottom of the table, Charlton Athletic with nine points. And then reading up the table, second bottom, Barnsley with 11 points. Third bottom, Millwall with 13 points. Fourth bottom, moving down, are Sheffield Wednesday with 15 points. Fifth bottom, climbing the table, are Sunderland with 15 points.